frame notch is all in. Everything, Ford 9. That's all hooked up to the drive shaft. Everything's set. Um, all I gotta do now is hook up the brakes. Just gonna run the lines to the new hose here. Uh, I ran all new stainless steel brake lines. Um, I didn't think that's what I got for a kit, but apparently that's what I got. Yeah, stainless steel brake lines. Um, just gotta run the wiring kit. Uh, I gotta run that out, hook up my clutch. Uh, yeah, there's the old frame out there. I had this door off, the other door off. We had the cab completely off that frame. And then I just kinda slid this frame from where it was sitting to over here, dropped it down. And now that cab is on the new frame. So, yeah, not bad, not bad. Um, I guess I just bolted up the master cylinder there. Bolted that up. Got the cab all bolted down. Now we just gotta run power wires here and there for the wipers and stuff like that. Um, gotta put a couple engine mount bolts in. And the engine will be bolted down. And then I can finally start on the turbo log manifold for that but I got a couple other things I gotta buy first I gotta buy the either I'm getting a 625 or a 750 magna fuel because that is what happened to this motor over here that I ran out of fuel on a couple pulls I had it gapped and took it apart but I'm not I'm not even going to worry about that with this motor. It's the 6.0. I'm not even taking the motor apart. Um, people say if you bring the power in above 5,500 RPM, you usually don't have to tamper apart. So we'll see what happens. Uh, yeah. So all I got to do now is just run the wires. Um, and I'll probably hide the ECU inside the glove box this time. And I'm going to run my staging brake. I'm gonna run that, the boost gauge, I'm gonna put up on the, the A pillar. And yeah, this is pretty much just an update video. Um, yeah, just where it's at right now. I know I haven't posted in a few days, but we're getting there. So, I mean, I got the milestone done, I got the cab on. Now I just gotta get drop spindles in, the drop springs out of that frame in. And then, yeah, just, hook it all up pretty much and fire it up and then do a little bit of tuning so hopefully within a month this thing will be completely on the road and ready to go all right just making a short update video for you guys and letting you know where it's at yeah stay tuned for more to come that summer's coming soon so hopefully burnouts and racing all right stay tuned guys